Hi guys, it's Mrs. S, and we're going to talk a little bit more about the book called Being Fit. And as we read today, we're going to be working on things called the central idea and the key details. And the central idea is like a key ring. Only the key details that support the central idea can go into the key ring. The central idea connects all the details together. And today we're going to be looking for key details about the things that you can do to be fit. So as I read, follow along and listen carefully. Fit and active. Being fit means being healthy. When you are fit, your body works well. You have the energy you need to be active. Your body is at a healthy weight. And as I turn the page, you will notice that we have headings. And headings can help us understand what we are about to read in this part of the book better and help us finding key details. Kids who are fit eat healthy foods from the five food groups. They eat fruits and vegetables, dairy foods, grains, and proteins like meats or nuts. Fit kids exercise almost every day. And the text says that kids who are fit eat healthy foods from the five food groups. That is a key detail for our central idea. Exercise for fitness. It's easy to exercise. All you have to do is play. You can play soccer or go swimming. You can ride your bike, jump rope, or dance to your favorite music. Running and walking are great exercises too. Exercises like running or riding your bike are called aerobic exercises. Aerobic exercises make your heart and lungs strong. They also help your body burn calories from food. This helps you keep a healthy body weight. You can do exercises to make your muscles stronger too. Crunches or sit-ups build strong stomach muscles. Push-ups strengthen your arm muscles. So does swinging across the monkey bars. Stretching exercises are important too. They help make your body flexible so that you'll not get hurt easily. Bending over to touch your toes is a good stretch. Now do you remember what this section of the book was about? That's right, it was about all the different ways that we can exercise. And what does this section say you can do to be fit? That's right, there were so many different ways and things you can do to be fit, like swimming and biking and stretching. Great job. Why be fit? Learning how to be fit now can help you stay healthy later. Exercise can make it easier for you to pay attention at school too. It can help you have more energy and sleep better. Exercising can even make you feel happier. Tips for success. Warm up your body slowly when you're exercising. Then you can work harder. Make sure to drink plenty of water while you exercise. Most kids need about an hour of exercise every day. But you do not have to get all your exercise at once. You can run around the playground at recess and ride your bike after school. You can even do push-ups as you watch TV. Anytime you can get your body moving, you'll be making yourself fit. Now, you guys have an assignment to do in your HMH book. Here on page 40. Our central idea is that there are many things you can do to be fit. And I want you guys to give me two key, key details. You can draw or write them. And one key detail that I remember is that we could eat healthy foods to keep us fit. Let's see if you guys can think of the other key detail that we read that can help us stay fit. Have a good day, guys. Bye.